Hi, in this video I'm going to show how to merge two workbooks or worksheets where you have a unique identifier for both. And the methodology for doing this is index match match. So we see on this tab we have this unique identifier here. And then on this tab we have this aim unique identifier. So what we're going to do is copy over these headers, paste them at the end, and the formula is equal index, then go over to the other tab and highlight the information. Do not include the unique identifier or the header. So then lock it with F4 and comma match. Then want to head back over to sheet A and click on the unique identifier. And we want to lock it so the dollar signs in the front only because we're going to be able to drag it down and to the right and it'll keep it on the unique identifier. Then comma. Then go over to the other tab and select the unique identifiers. Do not include the top one and go down to the bottom. Then you want to lock that as well with F4, comma, zero, close parenthesis, comma, match. Then go back over to the sheet A. Click on the first header and then lock that with F4, so the dollar sign's in the middle, the letter, and the number, comma, go back to the second tab, select the headers that we're bringing over, lock that with F4, comma, zero, close parenthesis, double parenthesis, accept, and there we go. So now we could copy paste that there drag it out to over here and we're good and that's it down here we have NA simply because there wasn't this unique identifier on this tab correct and for the top ones we did have a match, so we expect that to show up here. And 